Yo, what's up guys, today we are going to play through all chaos, we are playing on the newest version, which is 3.5 uh, It's not very public version, it's been released only for the patrons of the map editor He runs a patreon and apparently someone leaked it, so now we can play it uh, I also checked he had the 150 bucks earning per month I would say it's like the most, one of the most successful um, map editors in Warcraft. The guy really earns a lot. Jesus Christ, man. I gotta, I gotta run my Patreon better way, I guess. Because I'm earning like 10 or something. 10 bucks. I know, like, I'm not providing content there and I'm not even publishing anything for already like two years, but <laughs> dude, I don't know. Alright, anyway. As you can see, there is a new thumbnail as well. So there are new items and their combinations that are like uh, also sets or something like that I don't really know what it does I'm very confused when I'm looking at this uh, diagram on the top left but let's go okay we're playing Void Elves, I played already with Race once we played uh, Terror from the Void which was kind of okay but I kind of want more I don't think it's enough alright the music box, so I had to press Ctrl M. Uh, attack rate, damage, HP, phasing missiles, reduction on armor. Affects the heroes, but doesn't affect special units. And self invulnerability plus movement speed. It's kind of good. This is kind of good. Um, it uses spell damage, increases armor. Cleaving swing on tier 1 melee, steal buffs from units. What am I playing against? Okay, there are a lot of buffs to steal from Dwarf and Torrents, but. Mm. Lifesteal, Critical Strike, Warpal Blades, Max Ethereal, Near Invulnerability. Well, I feel like you can't really go wrong with this one. Like, that's. That's not too bad of a foundation, the custom one. Before that, yeah, I went for a tier 4 unit, and it was also kind of good, but let's play something different today. Don't mind playing different strats. We have Undead on the left side, and kind of good uh, neutral buildings on the right side. Also average neutral buildings. And but there is a torrent who's gonna be pushing me most likely and it was dwarf right in front of us okay we're gonna upgrade on the middle then my race is one of the weakest uh early game because so many debuffs 12 percent damage and 10 percent hp reductions like they're ridiculous but I get with casters with invulnerability and armor reduction. Armor reduction is like, of course, the most interesting thing. I don't know why there is a, a freaking uh, invulnerability and movement speed for a caster. Where is going to run to? <laughs> like I don't, I don't get it honestly. Like melee unit, yes, it can dash. It's literally like a dash for the melee unit, but oh well. Names are kind of familiar of these players, so I feel like they might be decent. They might be pretty decent. There are two possibilities. Uh, if Undead doesn't upgrade his barrack, we keep it tier 1 barrack against each other. We both have special units, additional units uh, from the barracks. So we can capture these neutral buildings on tier 2 main. But if he upgrades, I will, ha I will be forced to do that. Okay, so... Three people, including me, went for the middle. Um, and then, like, a second scenario is like... Yeah. The Torrent is very scary. Okay, a guy went for tier 2 masonry. Which is not too bad, I guess. Yeah, okay, let's upgrade on, on the right side. He's gonna be pushing me 24-7 otherwise. 
I have to respect this. I'm so afraid of undead acting uh, like defensively. But not much I can do about it. Yeah, because of invulnerability, my casters have. Like, they, they, they die last actually. It's pretty funny. Alright. Yeah, he didn't upgrade his barrack, that's amazing. Uh, no, I feel like he will upgrade the barrack eventually. Because he's facing undead. Uh, he's facing dwarf and me. And I feel like I might be even be stronger than dwarf a little bit. With my tier 1 barrack. You know what I mean? So because there is no threat against a dwarf, he might upgrade against me. But it's a gold mine. Yeah, I saw that. Like 50 gold. I think it's a gold mine. So he might upgrade towards a gold mine. That would be amazing. Okay. <clears throat> so yeah, the plan is 3-1 uh, upgrades. 3 on damage, 1 on defense. And then upgrade on the casters. And then upgrade masonry. Just amplifying my power on the right side and on the middle. Uh, so far, yeah, I played only one game on the Void Elves. It was on stream. I feel like it was yesterday, like two days ago. Yeah, two days ago. Uh, and yeah, it was pretty fun. The race is kind of confusing. It has a lot of uh, interesting tower tower upgrades, but nothing too broken. Units explode and deal damage on death. Uh, there are glaives on tier two unit and no, it's a tier, it's a extra unit each wave and tier four. Uh, mana per hit, create illusions for tier one melee, invulnerability and movement speed. Like this one is literally the best. Yeah, so my melee units turn invulnerable and they dash with the movement speed. Okay, Torin is doing something weird. I feel like he's going tier 3 mid or something, or like early tier 2. The guy didn't upgrade masonry, the guy didn't get a single upgrade. It's very weird. What are spells? Uh, curse, 25% chance to miss. Uh, second one is going to be... I don't remember actually. Oh yeah, armor reduction. Ooh, wait, so I'm gonna be stacking armor reduction. I have this. Orb effect. And then I will have also armor reduction spell. Isn't that too broken? Isn't that like literally too broken? <laughs> I feel like it's pretty good. Agree? Like, <laughs> I'm gonna reduce armor by... By like... Uh, 14. I'm gonna reduce armor by 14. That's the best foundation then. Oh my god. The, there is a spell that, yeah, see? Reduce armor by 6. And then if I get all the caster upgrades, it's gonna reduce by 8 on hit. So they hit something, minus 8. They cast a spell, additional minus 6. Yeah, bro, like, uh, I know that's kind of OP. I don't know. Uh, speaking of OP, Undead is playing very weird way. So I feel like he didn't upgrade a single barrack, but he upgraded his units to to the max, literally, almost to the max. Two free upgrades and one caster upgrade. But they still no tier 2, either on me or on my right side, so... That's kind of weird, yeah. I don't know what to think about it. Yeah, the question is, do I want to upgrade more armor, or I want to rush tier 2? I feel like I want to rush tier 2, yeah. For extra unit on each barrack. I can claim these buildings then, without going tier 2. I'm so confused. How am I pushing this Torrent? Okay, Torrents... Uh, okay, yeah, he did upgrade on the middle. Yeah, I, I, I foreshadowed that. And also, his foundation is... Uh, this thing. Is it hitting him? Like, what does it do even? 
I'm kind of confused. His Wind Rider got replaced by that Spirit Wyvern or whatever it is. Yeah, Spirit Wind Rider. Why is it like a rider? There are no riders. It's just a, a Wyvern, right? But yeah, it looks like it, it has LU heal and uh, face shift. It's kind of Pepega, honestly. I know why he went for it. <laughs> yeah, interesting uh, playstyle. The guy makes a lot of units to defend against me. I'm afraid he's gonna upgrade the barrack instead of doing upgrades. Alright. Anyway. Yeah, we get extra unit each wave. And also I want to upgrade the void form. Uh, in modern beauty and movement speed. It scales really badly with upgrades. Like 0.25 extra in modern beauty and 0.5 extra speed. But when you get it on level 1, it's amazing. Okay, let's see if he did upgrade on me. If he did, I will match it. Yep, he did on me, okay. So, we're gonna upgrade the barrack on the left side. That's a uh, top 1 priority for now. Yeah, like, minus 4 armor. He's finally taking, making upgrades. Okay, go from middle. I have the most go from middle. Isn't my race, like, super weak? What the fuck? Like... All the races have normal like uh, buffs, my race has minus damage, minus HP. This guy has plus 10% HP, minus 10% attack rate. Dwarf has uh, attack rate, minus but plus HP as well, I think. And on that, has like minus HP, if I'm not mistaken. Dwarf went tier 2 mid. Yeah, I see that, but he's not really farming it. He has free free upgrades. No upgrades on melee. I like his playstyle. I feel like Dwarf is good. I gotta be wary of him. Okay, okay, okay. Now what I want is... What I want... Do I want the Glaives on my extra unit each wave? It's only one unit, I don't know. It's gonna increase its damage by twice as much. I kinda wanna get the caster upgrade as well. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna go for the caster upgrade, I think. Yeah, I'm gonna go for the caster upgrade. I think it's a pretty good idea. Thorin's finally dominating mid. He has a lot of spirit wind riders. So let's just work for him. Thorin looking strong, but I know. I think I will manage. I should manage at least. Uh, what's also eye-catching? Uh, Phantom Image. My units will start creating illusions. I think that's pretty good. Of themselves. Man, there are a lot of units. Let's make extra, extra 2 melee, tier 1. Otherwise I feel like I will lose it. Maybe I overdid it. Yeah, I don't know. Alright, anyway. Yeah, I'm, and I also really want to upgrade uh, on mid. I feel like I can kick him out. I can totally kick him out of the middle. With two casters, just two casters, and they also have foundation. Like, right now, just for the info, they reduce armor by 6 on attack, and they also can reduce armor by 6 using the spell. I don't know if it's not broken, man. I feel like it's really broken, actually. <laughs> it's really, really broken. Yeah, that's gonna be the plan, okay? So we upgrade the barrack. And then we're gonna go for more upgrades on damage. More damage upgrades. Maybe like two upgrades on armor. And then... Two extra upgrades on mercenary. 
that's my plan. <clears throat> yeah, minus six armor by spell, right? Is it spell? No, it's attack. It's a spell. For some reason, they don't cast spell on the same target, they attack. Uh, there is Kel for that, but I don't know. Okay, Torrent sent a hero as well. Do I like. Do I have a war with Lamb for the middle? And also send heroes? I don't know. I mean, I guess I could if I really wanted to. Yeah, I don't know. Minus HP, and I have only one armor upgrade though. Okay, let's just wait for it. Uh, I'm gonna finish my upgrades and we can then probably do something like that. Send a hero on me. Yeah, I'm, I don't know though. Actually... Okay, let's send hero now. I wanna send hero now. Zoom is slightly ahead. Well, that's not true. Watching if they upgrade their barracks. To tier 3. Doesn't happen. How about if I just stand over here? Okay. Okay. Now we should be in the middle. Uh that guy has a very good skill set. He can, like creates uh, illusions. There are some damage spells as well, so he should be a good choice. Should be a good choice. Okay, cast it there. Uh, how you spell? Alright, I'm actually dying. There are too many of his spirit wind riders. Oh man, come on, please! You don't die! You don't die so fast, dude! What the fuck? I'm dead, help me! Oh no. Am I going to lose the hero already? Ah, shit. To barrack. Tier to barrack. Oh, he went back for some reason? What the fuck? Wait, he was here. Like, he went back, literally. Kek? Yeah, Toran accumulated too big of an army. I didn't know, dude. I guess it was a mistake after all. Yeah, he died. Nice hero, by the way. <laughs> Shit, dude. What the fuck are these things? That are like, there are so many of them as well. And my units are made out of paper, like they're just getting killed. Yeah, now Blue has most of the gold from the middle. I'm pretty sure about that. And I invested 1k and it didn't pay off at all. Fuck. Alright, now what? Uh, yeah, let's step back and get uh, mercenary upgrades. Survival OG name, yeah. Okay, he made tier 3. We're gonna match it. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna, after this upgrade, I immediately will match this. Just hope that Undead will not do the same. But he doesn't look like he he's doing it. Man, he just buys a lot of OP units that he has. He purchased two Wind Riders. Man, like, what the fuck? What's up, Bjorn? How are we doing? I'm 
and that also upgrade to tier 3. But yeah, we're kind of beating that guy too much. Yeah, now I gotta finish the mercenary upgrades and then finish the armor upgrades and also get some of his passives. Ability to sound units like one level in this, two levels in phantom image, so illusions last at least 20 seconds. And yeah, we're pretty good then. We're pretty good. Uh, ricochet later. Okay, I think I can do it in time, but might be not true. There's gonna be a wave, so... Yeah, I hope I have time for it. Oh, and that made tier 4 upgrade on me. Yep. Uh, I like that there is a dwarf in the game as well. I think he gonna start pushing side lanes more than pushing middle. If tier 4 and tier... Tier 3 and tier 4 barracks on the sides. So I'm kind of waiting for that. Maybe maybe I upgrade my tier 4 barrack on Thorin and try to push him. Hmm, I don't know. I don't really know, man. Can keep pushing me faster, so I can use the spell already. I might need to use my axe spell. Yeah, let's use axe spell when the wave, extra wave, gonna arrive. Is it extra wave already? There you go. Because his strength with tier 4 is tier 3, my strength is, is tier 4. I'm gonna try to outmatch him with that. Now that I have a tier 4 unit as well, uh, I wanna get glaives for my, my extra units in each wave and my tier 4. Yeah, yeah, I, I know that I'm... Actually, yo, no, no, okay, I feel like Undead might win it. Yeah, Undead will win the middle. Undead will win the middle. It's a Silvanas that makes Abominations. Plus Abomination Foundation. So, tier 4. Yeah, Abominations explode, you're gonna win the middle. I'm pretty sure about that. Jesus Christ, man, they're so broken. Huh? The fuck is this? Like, how long did they stay there? The Spirit Windriders, dude, like that. <laughs> Unkillable, literally. Alright. Mm, is there anything specifically that I wanna get? Yeah, I feel like my Sorks gotta get this uh, stun spell. At level 1, at least. I still gotta push my armor upgrades. My units are too fragile. Jesus Christ. Keeps on sending two of them. Like he, he trains additional uh, air units to amplify his push. So is he winning? Pretty sure he killed his hero, right? I can see only Silvanas. Yeah. Oh, it's not Silvanas. Yeah, it's a uh, pure keeper. There is Silvanas. Alright, never mind me. You are tier 2 barrack, good, good. I don't have really a power to withstand abominations as of right now. Air takes no damage. Yeah, that's triggering me. It's so broken. 
Well, it's a default barrack of mine against his tier 3 and I'm still not really like super pushing him. A phantom image level 2. Because like yeah, 10, 10 seconds, illusions. It's not enough. To could have last uh, 20 seconds in my opinion, at least. Alright. There goes my fifth upgrade on armor. I have no idea, like, how, how am I having trouble against Wind Riders? So, once again, I have a spell that reduces armor by 6. Let me, let me watch this. There, there you go. And when my units hit, they reduce by another 6. So, it's minus 12 armor. I have minus 12 armor, focus fire on his air units, and he still wasn't dying. Like... Huh? How does that work even? Okay, he made tier 4 barrack. That's good, that's good. Okay, we, we're gonna send him a hero when he's gonna bounce back. Does it all work on the heroes, the armor reduction it is? I wonder. Probably not, would be too OP. Uh, void implosion is not bad. I wonder if it works on illusions or not. Yeah, they don't cast a spell. I'm pretty sure the auto attack works. Yes. Yes, it works. Mm hmm. Okay. Yeah, that's the info that I needed to know. What else is good now? We have 6-6 six, six, except for air units and uh, base damage. I don't think I need it now that much. Yeah, it's either like a tag or a tier 4 middle barrack. But I don't think I can compete against abominations. Abominations Dark Ranger are way too strong. It's one of the strongest uh, pushes in game. He didn't get a tier 2 on casters. This guy is Pepega. Hmm, I just, I'm thinking, yeah. Can I have a tag and a hero in time or not? I don't really know even. Because this is my only LU spell. I really need to get it. I really need to get it ASAP. And I will also have more armor reduction. It works so nicely against these heroes. Yeah, let's go attack. Fuck it. Let's go attack. Uh, I have the least amount of gold compared to everyone else. Uh, Blue has the most because he dominated the middle. Yeah, that sucks. But oh well. I hope he's gonna dump his gold in unnecessary things. It's good to write a TG when you know that you are not the strongest. So people will see that you are not the strongest and not aim you that much. But aim like a blue guy for example because yeah. Well yeah green is doing that right now. This huge mass of units gonna be big trouble for him. He will have to use his X spell. I'm pretty sure about that. Sylvanas spawning abominations with 2.5k HP. He is tier 4 barrack spawning abominations. They explode and do like uh, 300 damage it was, I think. In uh, 400 LE. That's obnoxious. Okay, he finally got a tier 2 caster upgrade and what do you see? Immediately pushes me. Uh, didn't upgrade corruption aura that much. I think that's a mistake, definitely. Yep, it's going. Wait, he casted his X spell now? It's too early! Wait, it's too early, what are you doing? Wait, what are you doing? It's too early! He will destroy you! Oh my god, his barrack is gone. His barrack is fucking gone, dude. Only he gets pushed by from the top as well. What is he doing? 
albums exploding, dealing enormous damage. Okay, he might survive, but like, that was a very unnecessary uh, damage take. And I kill his hero? My units just killed his hero midway. They cancelled his push. Omega lol? I'm going mid. Yeah. I know why, but I got a lot of gold right now, so... Ah, shit. Oh, shit, actually, wait. Wait. Am I gonna be fine? The skeleton archer is burning in my buildings. It's really powerful. Okay, kill casters first. Yeah, there goes my LE spell. Helps a little bit at least. But I'm still like... I'm still on fire. Um, oh, it's a tier, tier 3 barrack, okay. He declares a war to me. That motherfucker. Come on, come on, come on. Please, fast, 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 fast. I don't wanna train you in. I need to barrack, I need to barrack, I need to barrack. Please, 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 please. Jesus Christ, dude. That's so unlucky. Oh, I just his bottom barrack. Kek? Kek? <laughs> what? Alright. I feel like I, I'm not gonna train a single unit until I get a tearful barrack. And, and I mean, I'm not gonna like make a, a single upgrade, that's what I meant. I gotta cast it, man. I gotta cast it. His push is too strong. I don't wanna train billion units. I really need to go to get a tearful barrack ACP and focus on green now. It really switched like all my focus from blue, who was pressuring me so much, towards green. Yup, you see? You see that? Abominations. He is rushing me now. This piece of shit, man. He damaged my barrack so much. Like that was a very unreasonable damage. I, I really blame myself for taking so much. Please, can I just get it in time? Please? Please? Fuck off. That's so bad. Alright. Yeah, but regardless, it's... it's okay. That's okay. Uh... Blue sent two heroes on mid. I feel like my units alone will kill his heroes. <laughs> That's so funny. GG. Yeah, GG. Okay, let's go and make more upgrades on units. Just a few more. Yep, what did I say? The dwarf with tier 4 and tier 4 side lanes starts to kill people. Because no one really paid attention to him. That's like a usual game for dwarf. Bunker up. Don't commit to mid too much. Go side lanes tier 4. Destroy people. Uh, okay, I need to get the uh, ultimate weapon because there might be some missiles shot at my barracks. I would not like that. I also need this. Yeah, I I need to start making these upgrades. While well, I'm making them, maybe like void implosion. Now that I have three barracks with tier four, there are a lot of units dying, so they explode. Just don't know if it's that good. It's like 150 LE. It's basically like. Scratch the back of that abomination with 10 damage. I feel like it's pretty garbage actually. Yeah, I don't like it. I really don't like it It's pretty bad the ricochet though is good um, What else? And LU damage spell on my special units is both buffs Yeah, this is my Damage spells, basically. Yeah, let's go for it, yeah. Let's go for it. And maybe also another bounce. Another bounce. Yeah, why not? He sent Silvanas midway. Is he dumb? I'm just gonna send a super unit when I will receive that push. 
Yeah, but on the other hand, I need ultimate weapon to be researched already. This is like dwarf pushing. It's a tier 3 barrack from dwarf, it's not even tier 4 yet. So I might stop it, but probably I will not. Yo, what's up, Ruber? Thank you so much. I really appreciate it, man. Send hero on me to get experience. Nah, it's a garbage. You never found heroes for experience. Experience doesn't matter in Throw Chaos too much. Unless it's a super unit. He attacks only now. Uh, Undead has already attacked. Okay. Oof. Wait a second. I have two types of ultimate weapons now? Huh? What the fuck is that? Wait, I kill Silvanas? What the fuck? My wave is so strong that I killed Silvanas. Tier 4 Barrack on Tier 4 Barrack, and he sent Silvanas, and I still killed it. Is Void Elf actually broken? What the fuck? I guess it's because of the armor reduction. Okay, let's just watch this. Okay, so frontline units. We don't get debuffed. My casters are up, I guess. Debuff something! Debuff something, dude! Come on! Okay, focus on album. There you go. Nah, it's garbage still. Alright. Okay. What do you have? Tier 4? Yeah, tier 4. I don't I didn't see a tier 4 unit though. Okay, dude. Okay, dude. Sure. Sure. How about if I just stand over here? I won't send it now already. Maybe I should have waited until it arrives to my base. But it's okay. What are you doing? He wind walked and ran away. Yeah, okay, let's get. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Maybe upgrade uh, glaives to next level. Three bounces and even more attack rate for those for these glaive throwers. What is going on? Like I literally don't understand. How am I so strong? Did I really hit? Oh my god, and how is this guy so weak? No. Shit. Yeah, I should have waited. I thought he was strong, but... When I played against Void Elf, this guy was very strong. He looked like he was strong, but... So you say my melee is good? Plus damage. Oh, LU spell. Uh... What was that as well? Man, I, I summoned him twice already and both times he died. I sent him mid, he died. I sent him here with Tier 4 Barra, he also died. That's a very big disappointment. Maybe it's just... Like, no, I feel like it's just Dwarf being too strong. I'm pretty sure it's Dwarf being just too strong. Alright, anyway. We are receiving a ghost ship. We're gonna react to it with uh, our own. Super unit. Grace illusion summons void walkers. Uh, damage spell, damage spell. Like I know how he was, how was, how was he so bad? He really supposed to be good with his uh, skill set, but not really. Yo, what's up, style? Thanks so much, man. Really appreciate. Thirty two months. Hello there. Yo, really appreciate, man. Almost three years. Not quite yet, you know. Alright, anyway. Let's upgrade this. And we can shoot an offensive ultimate weapon. Uh, Dwarf has a very good game. He has uh, full mana. And he has also fountain. It's really... Uh, scary. His foundation looks like a... Is it, is it like a tier 2 unit? I don't remember. It's like... Okay. 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 So he has smite. What if I also go for smite? Yeah, what if I also go for smite? 
And I sent him uh, a super unit. What is a smite? I like that idea a lot. I feel like I can kill him then. No. Boom. Alright. Uh, let me think about it. Maybe it's a triple hero push on Undead. But then this guy will not get experience. I'm pretty sure it might be... Maybe I sent two heroes on mid. I sent two heroes on mid. Fuck it. I kinda wanna try to dominate it. Tierhu Berg, right? Okay. Did I miss drama in Discord while I was in vacation, or why did you leave the server? I just didn't want to play with anyone. Alright, uh, yeah, I know, I have too much gold. I might actually, okay, can, can you still buy a magic rune? I don't see it. Wait, did I remove the magic rune? Because I have a lot of gold, but these tower upgrades are garbage. Yeah, there is no magic rune, right? There is no magic rune anymore. They removed it. Ah, shit. So I will have enough for one smite eventually, but that's it. Mm. Armory damage return, that's bad. I don't like it. 10 damage flat. If it was percentage, I would think about it, but otherwise, nah. Units explode, okay, let's get it. Uh, doing the suiciding. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Let's see how it is. So, Red sent me a super unit on the right side. There are two of my heroes gonna be pushing through the middle. My super unit gonna push him from the left side. Okay, as soon as this guy dies, I think I sent him through the middle. So, it's a triple push, triple hero push through middle. And... Super Ruin from the left side. Wow, his Super Ruin gonna go right. I think it might be successful then. Let's get Ricochet. I have too much gold, man. My Super Ruin didn't die. It's not gonna... Like, I, I like to save up gold because this guy dies. And then I send him again. It's still a mystery, like, uh, what foundation did he pick? It might be a Smite. Then Ricochet is kind of a bad idea. I don't like it, man, yeah. I'm gonna cancel it. I'm gonna cancel it if something happens. We have almost full upgrades on units. I like that. Okay. So it's a triple hero push on middle. Tier 4 barrack as well. He reacts with a Muradin. Don't use any spells yet. It's not very important upgrade. Six upgrades on Masonry, he goes for a very late game. I stopped at four and that's it, but like, that guy. His barrack is going down slowly. Use the X spell finally, so he is shorter on mana. The barrack is still going down. Okay, not anymore. I feel like he, he knows how to refocus damage, right? So his barrack doesn't get attacked. Man, do I really go for it? Maybe I save up. Okay, I save up now, I save up now. Heroes will start dying. Yeah, I gotta save up though. The fucking dragon hoax can't just live without uh, too much damage on them. Alright. Alright, let's see. I could send a hero to the left side of his to support my super unit, but it's gonna take ages to get there. And there are already two heroes, nah, I don't think it's a good idea. I don't have enough for smite. I have a lot of gold once again. Uh. 
Okay, so it's Muradin. Super unit on the left. Okay, let's... Uh... Hmm. If I sent heroes, they would have been here, I think. Maybe I should have done that. Maybe I should have done that. Oh, he chose repair. Okay, so his, his spell is repair. He's a repair Andy. Man, maybe I should have gotten that. Maybe I should have gotten that, actually. Just don't know. Oh, super unit is dying! He's dying, finally! Okay. So I can react with my super unit on the right side. Oh, send it mid. Nah, mid is gonna be too fast. I can prepare attack on the other sides then. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Pretty sure it's gonna be quadruple hero push on the right side. And then we're gonna somewhat defend against these guys without hero. Any heroes. Agree? Send it. No. Okay, try to re aggro the super unit from the barrack. He ignores my focus fire, though. Pretty much. <laughs> yeah, my towers are attacking him, my barrack is not attacking him. But he doesn't give a shit, he just fights my. my Naru. I know. Is it really smite or it's uh, defensive spells? Yeah, let's attack it with Barak as well. He's not paying attention anyway. Middle push is coming with Muradin. Muradin gonna be annoying. Fuck fast. But yeah, it's gonna be easier to re aggro Muradin though. Look. Ah, my hero went mid. That's not too bad, nor it's too good. Okay, finally I can re aggro him. Right? Yep. Re aggro, re aggro, re aggro. much gold like normally I buy magic rune because I have that much gold but yeah this time I feel like I gotta okay we're gonna wait for the smite hopefully I'm gonna collect enough for the smite when the tech gonna arrive here uh yeah I don't know what is very good burning mana on each attack it's good against blood elves because they have mana on each unit almost each unit but it's not that good against dwarf I think least especially a mechanical unit probably doesn't affect it yeah uh, this one is good on level one this one is good on level two I think it's enough this one is bad this one is okay I guess we just yeah let's get this as well he can't smite my super unit we checked his ultimate weapon so yeah okay I think I think the plan is pretty clear He sends a super unit to smite it. They're gonna be a push from the middle, they're gonna be a push from the right side. The left side push, we're gonna just deal with only this guy. Oh, it's, it's here there, it's here actually. Uh, fuck. Trying to reagro. What you made? Come on, aggro on this tower. Yeah. Oh well. Yeah, the units aggro, but the heroes like they don't move. <laughs> Finally, okay. Can my main reach him? I don't think my main can reach him. It can. Can you? 
Yeah, you can. It can, it can, it can, it can, it can, it can. Okay, good. Now they're gonna attack my main only. Bam! Huh? It didn't die? Oh, shit. Alright. Ah, it's still fine, I guess, but... Yeah, I didn't think a super unit can have more than 30k HP. <laughs> But I guess it can. Can he have a second uh, super unit or not? Man... I don't know, what should I go for? Yo, Yarik, thank you for the follow, much appreciated. GG. Yeah, GG. And why he goes GG? Does he think he's losing that much? Or maybe he is. I have 5,000 gold, like... Give me a break. What do I even go for? Okay, illusions. Uh, hysteria. Uh, it's like... Affects only organic units. So it's... Eh. Meh. No, 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 no. It's all garbage. Oh, I can help more than... Oh, I can help 12 upgrades of these. That's what I should have gotten. Can my two heroes kick out Muradin? I hope they can. I hope they can. Uh, maybe Super Unit is off the cooldown from the middle as well. So my Super Unit dies, I send him on the middle again. I hope that's gonna be the case. He left the game. Alright, GG. We won, boys. Mana Bion is always good. Nah. No, I don't like it. I don't think it's good. I can explain why. It deals half damage. It has it deals like half damage to the mana burned. Units with mana on dwarf. There are like two of them. So like when you know when your melee units are already reaching his casters, they're gonna die regardless. When you range and melee units reaching them, they're gonna die regardless. You don't need it. And when you have like a clash with a hero against a hero, tier 4 on tier 4 barracks. Uh, I just don't know, like, they, they don't, they barely use mana anyway. So they don't even care. And their mana region is pretty good, so... I don't think it's good. I think it's good maybe in case you have like a foundation with lots of good archers. If, you are, if your rangers got amplified, and like they're always in combat, and there are a lot of them, and they're very strong, then... Whatever you give them, like any passive, like Mana Burn, I think it might be good, but, yeah, I don't know. Yeah, the guy left. I kinda wanna finish him now. Okay, dude. Yeah, he had only Muradin, but now it's also Boron Thorzin. Well, anyway, yeah, GG, good game.